Among Us really violate the Geneva Conventions? In today's episode of Facts to Hurt Your Brain, we will be questioning just how serious international laws can be when it comes to video games. But before we jump in, let me ask you this. Have you ever imagined that a simple symbol in a game could lead to war crime accusations? So firstly, what is Among Us? For those of you that might not be familiar, Among Us is a widely popular multiplayer game where players work together on a spaceship. It's all about teamwork and working out who amongst the crew is the imposter. All seems innocent enough, right? And then, what are the Geneva Conventions? Well, they're a set of international laws. They were established to regulate the conduct of nations during times of armed conflicts. And these aren't the run-of-the-mill laws. They are the foundations of ensuring humanity even in the darkest of times. So, the symbol in question. And how did Among Us break international law? Well, if you've played the game before, you might have noticed this. The Red Cross. The big red cross is a big deal in the eyes of the Geneva Conventions. This isn't just any symbol. It is an emblem of immense significance. It is the emblem of mercy. The red cross symbol is universally recognized. It is a sign of humanitarian assistance and medical services. It's a symbol of safety, care, and neutrality during times of conflict. When you see a red cross, it is a promise that lives will be protected, that medical help is nearby, and that humanity is upheld. So what are the consequences for misusing this symbol? Well, misusing this symbol is outright against the law, and using it without permission will lead to great consequences. When this emblem is displayed in context is unrelated to the protection of the wounded and sick people, it diminishes the power of it and can lead to confusion. Imagine this, right? A soldier in distress, seeing a red cross, expecting help but finding none. It's a matter of life and death. And the Geneva Conventions take the protection of this emblem very seriously. Unauthorized use of the Red Cross emblem is not just a slap on the wrist. It's a breach of international law. And as Among Us gained worldwide popularity, it caught the watchful eyes of international human rights law. To put it all in perspective, violation of the Geneva Conventions, even unintentionally, can have significant consequences for game developers and publishers. And it's a reminder that even international law can reach the virtual realms of gaming. And so, there you have it. The astounding tale of Among Us and the Geneva Conventions. Who would have thought that such a seemingly innocent symbol could lead to such a serious situation? And the story just highlights the profound importance of respecting international law, and maybe more importantly, doing your research. What a dumb mistake to make. But what do you think, honestly? What do you think about this whole scenario? Do you agree that the Geneva Convention laws should be held against the publishers and creators of Among Us? Or do you just think it's a game? Who would think that symbol in the game has any importance? Let me know down in the comments. And before you go, don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. And make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell so you get notified the second I release another video. And come back for the next episode of Facts to Hurt Your Brain. <laughs> Until next time.